Bro, it takes nothing to actually make a video. It takes nothing to actually speak on what I need to speak on and do it at a high efficient level. Like just for the people that are interested, man. More so, these are the best Juice World songs specifically for a party. So you're looking at playlists, you know, people that want to be energetic, people that think like, oh yeah, like Juice World is sad all the time. Juice World is just a sad person all the time. Like Juice World doesn't have all sad music as we know that. Now, I don't know how long this video is going to be, but hold on, I got to update. I got to update on the numbers. I got to bang, bang. You feel me, man? So we're getting step by step closer and closer to the main and the ultimate goal. And overall, I just need to keep telling myself not only to keep working towards the goal of being great, but also just to keep posting. Honestly, like just keep posting videos, keep making more and more videos and keep getting better at the ultimate craft of just not only being a content creator, but being a YouTuber on this platform and on all my platforms, because I really want to be successful in this field. Um, I don't feel like I'm wasting time. I don't feel like I, I'm, I'm wasting any of y'all's time when y'all come through to see these videos, man. But on, on to the mix, on to the mix. Here we go, here we go. So, for release songs, for release songs, it's like anything that's a Juice World song that he has a collaboration on, but then again, it's, it depends on the collaboration when you're trying to listen to a song and keep a bunch of people upbeat. Because first and foremost, you already know if you're at a party setting, the chances of you hearing a Juice World song are very slim, very slim to none. And that's OK. Just people aren't like into that. You will probably hear Meek Mill 12 times before you hear one Juice World song. And that's and y'all already know what I'm talking about. Y'all already know what song I'm talking about. Y'all already know. But I'm saying if you trying to go for a release Juice World song, the the one that will probably get played the most is Bandit. It would probably be banded like release wise like i don't think more more people would be oh yeah let me play this uh this this collaboration with juice world and, and g herbo let me play this song that g herbo and, and juice got or young thug and juice world or ski mask and, and juice like i would say typically the best collaborations or some of the best collaborations that juice world has and some of the best and most energetic songs you will have v long thug or substance with juice world and, and g herbo you will have um world go round etc with young thug right and then you have a multitude of songs with ski mask and juice and hey mister you feel me uh uh get geeked get get geeked the v2 like typically when i'm more so if you go into a party it'll be one thing it would have to be just a bunch of Juice World fans there. It would have to just be a bunch of people that listen to Juice World because if you're playing unreleased Juice, people want to hear songs that they know the words to, right? People want to hear music or 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 be livened up or be like, oh yeah, this young fire to words that they know. So it's a, always going to be a released song and not really too many people listen to Juice World, especially in a party outgoing socializing function. With all that being said, you got to remember, like, what demographic of people are you working with? A bunch of emo people, punk people, you know, uh, trap type of rock people like or, or just trap music in general, rap music in general. Like, you got to understand your crowd of people and then be able to keep them happy. So that's why I'm saying if you're at a function, you're at a party, if you're on the art, uh, on the ox and, and, and you have to and you have to rely just make something or play something it will be like like you know for a fact that you want to listen to juice world you know for a fact you want to listen to juice world but do your friends really want to hear juice world because that the first main excuse is that all all these all these brickheads have right they'll be like juice world is only all he makes is sad songs all he has is sad music Ultimately, I, I would just say for that for the people that do say like he only has sad music, like I I, I feel bad for you, bro, because you you realize like you never did your own research, you don't listen to him, you don't know much, like and I'm saying it like I'm a crazy fan. I, I at this point the dude, I have a canvas right next to me, bro, like I, I have a poster in the background of the room. I don't like I don't make the rules, I just enforce them. But overall, 
it's really the unreleased songs that that get to people. The unreleased songs I will mainly start people off with. Guaranteed it is is rental. Hold on, I gotta go through my list. I gotta go through my list because it's like it's, it's, it's not only one song. If you want to get somebody hyped, I would listen to Contained and, and Rental for sure, for sure, for sure. If you try and not like disrespect a, a woman of some sort, maybe um, listen to I Don't Got Time or No Good Diamond Watching Woman, No Good. That that's that jump. Uh, uh, Flaws and Sins V two like. It's so many songs that you can listen to in a party uh, function, or if you're trying to just vibe in the car, or just vibe with your friends. Here, here we go, here we go again, and then here I go again. Those are two different songs. If y'all heard the way that I said it, um, if you're once again trying to vibe with somebody, play 24 Hours. You feel me? It's 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 so many songs. It's so many good. I mean, actually good songs. It, it, like another one that that's released now. You can play that now. It's a lot of songs in the C's and the D's and the E's and the F's. But I mean, like ultimately, it's going to be your choice on what song you play. I will always say Ashtray, My Bad. Just first of all, if you're trying to put somebody on the Juice Road, these are also songs I would I would play. And also, I'm going to save that for another video. But ultimately, man, y'all read the title of the video. Y'all understood it. Let me know y'all thoughts and opinions in the comments down below if this was helpful for the person that is the Juice World fan. But his friends or their friends don't listen to Juice World and say he only makes sad music. <sighs> Till next time, man. Take care of yourself. Love yourself. And I'm out. Peace. For every like. And every sub and every follow is another minute added to me having to wear this mask. How about that? How about that?